In a world where borders and boundaries seem to divide us more than ever, it's natural to wonder what life would be like if those lines were erased. One such hypothetical scenario that has gained traction in recent years is the idea of a united Ghana and Nigeria. With a combined population of over 200 million, a shared history and culture, and a strategic location on the African continent, the potential benefits of such a union are undeniable. But what would it take to make it happen? And what kind of challenges would a united Ghana and Nigeria face? In this video, we'll explore these questions and more, delving into the potential social, economic, and political implications of such a historic merger. Ghana and Nigeria are both in West Africa and share many cultural, historical, and linguistic similarities. Their shared cultural heritage is one of the two countries' most striking similarities. Ghana and Nigeria both have a rich musical, dance, and storytelling tradition, with indigenous languages spoken in both countries. Furthermore, both countries have a strong tradition of crafts and art, with a focus on textiles and pottery. Another point of convergence between Ghana and Nigeria is their shared history. The British colonized both countries in the 19th century, and they gained independence in the 20th. Both countries have a long history of Pan-Africanism and have been instrumental in the development of the African Union. As a result of their colonial history, both countries have English as their official language. Furthermore, in both Ghana and Nigeria, many people speak one of the indigenous languages, such as Twa in Ghana and Yoruba in Nigeria. The prospect of economic growth if Ghana and Nigeria merged as one country is an exciting one. The union of these two countries would result in a larger market for goods and services, which would boost economic activity and growth. The merger would also diversify the economy by combining Ghana's strong agricultural sector and Nigeria's strong oil and gas industry. A merger would also result in increased resource efficiency and an optimization of the economic structure. This would result in better economic policies and regulations that would benefit the entire new country. A merger would also increase international competitiveness and the ability to attract more foreign investment, both of which would benefit the economy. Furthermore, with a larger population and more resources, the country would be better able to address issues like poverty and unemployment. The merger would result in a higher standard of living for all citizens and a brighter future for the country. It is important to note that, as with any integration of two distinct countries, there will be challenges and obstacles to overcome. However, with careful planning, cooperation, and a willingness to collaborate, the merger of Ghana and Nigeria would result in a better future for the people of both countries. Increased trade and investment opportunities would be one of the most obvious benefits of a Ghana-Nigeria merger. The two countries' combined population would create a large domestic market that would attract businesses from all over the world. Increased competition would result, ultimately benefiting consumers by driving down prices and improving the quality of goods and services. Furthermore, a merger between Ghana and Nigeria would increase infrastructure investment in areas such as roads, ports, airports, and telecommunications. The ease of doing business in the merged country would be greatly improved, making it more appealing to foreign investors. A merger of the two countries would also result in increased cooperation in areas such as energy, agriculture, and mining. This would enable the merged country to create jobs and boost economic growth by leveraging its abundant natural resources. Despite the potential benefits of a merger, there are a number of obstacles that must be overcome. The integration of the two countries' political systems would be one of the most difficult challenges. 
This would necessitate extensive bargaining and compromise, as well as a willingness to give up some of the autonomy that each country currently enjoys. Another challenge would be integrating the cultures of the two countries. While Ghana and Nigeria have many cultural similarities, they also have significant differences that must be addressed. This would necessitate a high level of understanding and respect for one another's traditions and values. A merger of Ghana and Nigeria would result in a powerful new country well positioned to capitalize on the numerous opportunities available in Africa and around the world. While there would be challenges, the potential benefits of increased trade and investment opportunities would make the effort worthwhile. Ghana and Nigeria, two of Africa's most populous and economically important countries, have enormous potential for greater success if they work together. A merger would enable the pooling of resources and the sharing of expertise, thereby boosting economic growth and development. A merger between Ghana and Nigeria could increase productivity and efficiency in a variety of ways. Companies, for example, would be able to achieve economies of scale by combining the two countries' manufacturing sectors resulting in lower production costs and higher profits. Furthermore, a merger would allow for the creation of a larger and more diverse market, attracting more foreign investment and assisting in the creation of more jobs. Another significant advantage of a merger would be the ability to address common challenges and issues more effectively. For example, Ghana and Nigeria face similar issues in terms of poverty, education, and healthcare, which could be addressed more effectively with a coordinated approach. Furthermore, a merger would allow for more efficient use of resources in areas such as infrastructure and transportation, contributing to an overall improvement in the standard of living for citizens in both countries. Ghana is well known for its rich gold deposits, and is one of Africa's top gold producers. It also has significant bauxite, manganese, and diamond reserves. Nigeria, on the other hand, is Africa's largest oil producer and has vast natural gas reserves. Furthermore, Nigeria is abundant in solid minerals such as limestone, coal, and tin. The union of these two countries would bring together a diverse range of natural resources that would benefit the newly formed country greatly. Nigeria's oil and gas reserves would provide a steady source of revenue, while Ghana's gold and diamond deposits would diversify the economy even further. The merger would also create new opportunities for the exploration and development of other natural resources, such as bauxite, manganese, and solid minerals. Additionally, the merger would result in the sharing of technical expertise and resources in the mining and oil and gas industries, resulting in increased efficiency and productivity. This would result in more job opportunities and economic growth for both countries' citizens. A merger of Ghana and Nigeria would have significant implications in terms of increasing bargaining power in regional and international politics, as well as the potential to attract more foreign investment. One of the primary advantages of such a merger would be the resulting country's increased bargaining power on the international stage. With a combined population of over 200 million people, the new country would be Africa's most populous and would most likely become one of the continent's leading economic and political powers. This would give it a stronger voice in regional and international organizations like the African Union and the United Nations as well as more clout on key issues like trade and security. Another potential advantage of a Ghana-Nigeria merger would be increased ability to attract foreign investment. With a larger and more diverse economy, the new country would be able to offer a broader range of investment opportunities and compete more effectively with other countries for investment dollars. Furthermore, the merger would make it easier for international companies to do business in the region, 
because they would only have to navigate one set of regulations and laws instead of two. However, the merger would be a complicated process that would necessitate extensive planning and negotiation. Many obstacles would have to be overcome, including the need to reconcile different cultural, political, and economic systems, as well as the possibility of opposition from some quarters. A merger of Ghana and Nigeria as a single country would increase bargaining power in regional and international politics, as well as attract more foreign investment. However, it would be a complex and difficult process that would necessitate extensive planning and negotiation. A merger of Ghana and Nigeria as one country would present a number of challenges, but it could also bring many benefits if properly planned and executed. Creating a unified government and legal system would be one of the most difficult challenges. Both countries have distinct government and legal systems, and combining them would necessitate extensive negotiation and compromise. Additionally, dealing with cultural differences would be a challenge, as the two countries have distinct cultures and languages. Another issue would be the economy. Ghana and Nigeria each have their own economies and industries, and merging them would necessitate extensive coordination and planning to ensure that the new country's economy is stable and prosperous. Despite these challenges, a merger between Ghana and Nigeria as one country could bring many benefits. For example, a unified government and legal system could lead to more efficient decision-making and a stronger economy. Additionally, a merger would bring the two countries closer together, promoting greater understanding and cooperation between them. Probably of the merger would be the best thing about the merger would be the ability to leverage the natural resources human capital, and geographic location of both countries. The merger would bring together the oil-rich Nigeria with the industrial and agricultural-rich Ghana. This would create a powerful economy that could compete in the global market. In conclusion, while a merger between Ghana and Nigeria as one country would present a number of challenges, it could also bring many benefits. With proper planning and execution, a merger could lead to a more stable and prosperous future for both countries. The key is to work together, overcome the challenges and focus on the opportunities that lie ahead. So what do you guys think? Is this idea a hit or a miss? Let us know in the comments. We'd like to also appreciate you for watching Please Support Out content by clicking the like button and also subscribing for more content like this.